back to the grind where we do this every single day. It's full time. MMA. That's right. The channel's not getting false flagged anymore. No, it ain't. Hey. <laughs> you motherfuckers know what time it is. I think you know what time it is. I think this is gonna be a while. Wow. We made it. Hitters. We fucking made it. 1300 subs. All time high. Zero copyright strikes. Yeah. I'm feeling pretty good right now. I'm feeling really good right now. Fuck you, me, make quick hits. I said, fuck you, me, make quick hits. You beta, bagel, biting, bitch, boy. I said, fuck you, me, make you heard me, bitch. Damn. The new subscribers are saying, damn, what's he talking about? What's he talking about? I'll tell you what I'm talking about. I'm talking about that old fuck boy. That old fuck boy. I wish I was live streaming right now. Give me a second. I like this fucking boy. I'm about to. Hey, I'm taking my time with this one because this is the last time ever I'm ever addressing this pussy. Unless he wants to put a call on deck. So I'm taking my time with this one. I've been waiting a while for this one. One second, please. One second, please. Here you go, babe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's fucking time. That bagel beta bitch boy flagging my shit. Well, it just got appealed today. Today's the day. If you hitters remember, last week was the 14 business days that pussy had to be was taking legal action against me or my shit was supposed to get reversed. Well, that pussy tried to send YouTube another email, so we got held up a little bit longer, but that shitty little fake false fucking spoof email didn't work, and my shit just got restored. All my videos are back up. All my motherfucking copyright strikes are on green. So you know what that means. Tomorrow, I will be in Fuckboy's email. Tomorrow, I will be Fuckboy's Instagram personally, asking him if he... Wants smoke. Put a call on deck, video chat, motherfucking call on deck. You can do whatever. I know you. That I'm, that's the basics of what you'll do. But you're over there struggling on Patreon right now. You're over there struggling on Patreon right now. You had twenty. You know what? Let's take it to the beginning. I'm gonna take this to the beginning for anybody that doesn't know what's going on right now that might be motherfucking listening for the first time while I'm exposing this fucking pussy. In the very beginning, there was a motherfucking guy. His name was MMA Quick Tits. He had 20,000 subscribers. I was one. I joined the boat at about 18,000 subs, so I was pretty new. I had never thought about making a YouTube channel. I thought about doing none of this shit. I never thought about a subscriber. I never thought about a microphone. I never thought about the hitter community. I never thought about this fuck boy like that. This pussy started threatening us. One night I'm gonna go to Patreon for 20 a month. How about that? You're gonna wake up and I'm gonna be gone. And I'm just gonna be gone. And if you can't afford 20 month, you're broke. Get a new job. Like, bitch, 
I don't give a fuck if I can afford a hundred a month. Uh, if I can recall, you've never broken no motherfucking news in your life. That's real. You've never broke news in your life. You were entitled. You never... You put out half the content I put out. Your content was worse than mine. Your content never improved. Your content's not worth $5 a month. And that's just being honest. You've got 90 patrons. 90 patrons over there. Maybe 100 by now. That's 90 to 100 dumb fucks. That's 90 to 100 morons. Paying $20 a month for somebody's fucking shitty opinion. Somebody's shitty. It's not even like it's an ex fighter. It's not like Dan Hardy has a Patreon where he's actually over there giving you knowledge. You got a fuckboy that says, Oh, it's a wrestler. He's gonna push him against the fence, and then he's gonna try and lock his hands behind him. Any wrestler will know. If you've wrestled, you know this. He's just gonna try and lock his hands, and he's gonna try and take him down. Bitch, shut the fuck up. Anybody that watches MMA can tell you that. You ain't shit. You ain't got a man on deck, and that's all you ever fucking talked about. Man on deck. You're a hoe if I ever seen one. I've been up for about four or five months now, and all you've ever did was hit me from the motherfucking backside like a hoe and false flag my shit. You ain't never once like a man emailed me. You ain't never once like a man came over and said shit to me. You ain't never once like a man put a man on deck. All you ever did was act like a hoe. That's all ever. Quick shits. Even when you were fucking false flagging me, you put your girlfriend's name on the fucking complaint. You wouldn't even put your real name on the complaint. Cause you're a hoe. You ain't got no fucking men on deck. You come from fucking Beverly Hills, you Carlton ass nigga. What the fuck you time at? And didn't matter what you did, guess what? I ain't a hoe. I ain't stopping. You ain't stopping me, and no matter how many spoofs you send me, how many times you false flag me, how many times I get reset, what is this, the fourth time? This is our fourth channel, and we're still at an all-time high. We're, we're doing better than we've ever done before. And now we got green copyright strikes. Wow. And you're still over there, never fucking once. As many times as I've called you out, in the beginning, remember, I used to fucking advertise your shitty little site. Remember, I kept it respectful in the beginning. In the very beginning, all I ever did was, hey, I'm a fan of this guy. If you're wondering where he went, he went to Patreon for 20 a month. I'm going to be doing this for free. He thinks people are paying him 20. Here's the link if you want to go pay 20 a month. That's what I was doing. I never fucking disrespected this clown, this bitch, this hoe, this pussy. It's all disrespect now. All disrespect. Fuck this. Ooh. This motherfucker's a clown if I've ever seen one. All I did was advertise his shit when anyone went, Hey, you probably wouldn't have 50 fucking patrons if it wasn't for me. But what did he do? What did he do? He false flagged my shit. When YouTube didn't have their shit together, you could just false flag. I make so many fucking videos. I make five videos a day. I had a hundred videos up. All he had to do was flag four of them. YouTube didn't fucking look into it. They, it was an algorithm. They just kept flagging my channels down, flagging my channels down. Well, now YouTube's fixed, you fucking punk bitch. Now they gave me time to appeal it. And the appeals went through, and now my shit's back up. And now you're a fucking hoe, and now you got the fucking smoke you wanted. Now you're either gonna have to fucking ignore me like the bitch you are, or put a man on deck and answer the motherfucking phone. Give me your motherfucking phone number, I'll give you my motherfucking phone number, and we can motherfucking give the motherfucking fans what the fuck they wanna see. Now that's your bitch ass, put a call on deck and explain, answer to all the hoe shit you fucking did. Answer to all that hoe shit. And who better to put the motherfucking answer to the call than me? I tell you what, you get your little bitch ass homie, your little bitch ass fucking hoe ass fucking nut gobbler Vegeta with you. Me versus you and Vegeta. Motherfucking, we can do a motherfucking conference call, a motherfucking Skype video chat, bitch. However the fuck you want to do it, we can motherfucking make it happen. You can explain all the hoe shit you did and the hoe shit you been up to. And the hoe shit you're going to use. You're fucking planning on doing now that my motherfucking shit ain't getting copyrighted strikes Because I know you ain't gonna motherfucking just go out like that, right? I'd be embarrassed if you went out like that, bro 
I hope this ain't the last we hear from you. I hope you motherfucking respond when I'm at your motherfucking email tomorrow. When I'm at your motherfucking Instagram tomorrow. It's going to be me. My email is fulltimemma1 at gmail.com. That will be me in your fucking inbox tomorrow. I will be asking you why you're such a hoe. And if you're willing to put a man on deck. And I will be motherfucking waiting for your response. On Instagram, I'll ask you the same thing. My Instagram is on the motherfucking video. I know you're listening, you fucking puss. So with that being said, I really ain't got too much else to say. It's a celebration, you guys. It's a motherfucking celebration. We got a new intro. Because we ain't getting false flagged by trigger trolls no more. I'm fucking happy, you guys. We fucking did it. We fucking did it, man. I'm fucking... I'm, I'm excited, man. It's a celebration. What the fuck are we gonna do to celebrate, man? I don't know. I'm gonna think of something, but it's a motherfucking celebration. Uh, you, you already know what it is, man. As soon as I fucking get up tomorrow, I'm coming at this motherfucking dude full force. It's on, and it, I, 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 I'm gonna try and make this fucking saga as quick as possible, because you know it. This motherfucker was already in memory, but we just got these false flags appealed. So this motherfucker... <sighs> It's almost over. It's almost over. I'm at his motherfucking front door tomorrow, and if he don't answer, he don't answer. But if he does, he's going to have to answer for all the motherfucking ho shit he's been up to. With that being said, it is what it is. Let the hitters know what the fuck you tap in the comments, dude. And by the way, man, I don't know if I can live stream on this account because of that community strike because punk ass troll buster. But shit, you ain't really got to fuck with uh, full time MMA too. You ain't got to subscribe to that one unless you know. I'm still gonna keep that motherfucker up, but I'm not gonna upload every single video to that channel. I might have to live stream from there though. But if that's the case, I'll announce it on this channel and we'll be live streaming on that channel. So with that being said, man, it's a motherfucking celebration. We did it, boys. And we're at an all time high. We're at about 1,300 subs. On our very first channel, we were at 1,100 when we got flagged. Then that push flagged us again at 600. Then we got flagged again at 400. This is the fourth channel. We're back up to 1,300 with motherfucking green strikes and there ain't no more false flagging. You two's on that hoe. You two's motherfucking shut that shit down. Fuck, hey, that's what I'm talking about. And that, and that pussy, and that's one thing. He didn't shut his channel down. He got copyrighted down. He was using the wrong clips. That motherfucker was doing the wrong shit. Didn't how he wasn't up on his fair use game. So he lied to them fucking 90 people that are paying him $20 a month. And said, I'm shutting my own shit down. When really YouTube shut his shit down. So he lied to them clowns. They should be motherfucking on his neck. Wanting that money back for lying. And making it look like, oh, only the people that can afford me are watching me. Not only the dumbasses that believe you shut your shit down are watching you. So everybody. Everybody that's paying 20 a month, if you're listening to this, you might want to shut that shit down tomorrow. That's what I would do. Because he's been lying to your fucking ass and he's probably over there using copyrighted material. Somebody probably needs to be checking on his Patreon. I would love to see his motherfucking Patreon get shut down just out of motherfucking karma. I ain't going to spend the time out of my day to go shut his shit down. But he is a motherfucking hoe. And I'll be hoping that hoe responds to me. Because I'm fucking really excited right now. I'm happy we ain't got no copyright strikes. But I motherfucking it ain't that big of a deal to... I, I really really ain't dwelling on this dude like that. I'm gonna send him a motherfucking email and an Instagram since that's all that hoe's got. And I'm gonna motherfucking see what the fuck he's talking about. And if he don't respond, he don't respond. I ain't gonna be on his neck because he pushed out. But if he does respond, then hopefully we can get a call on deck and he can answer for all the motherfucking hoe shit he's fucking did with his bitch ass. With that being said, it is what it is. Let the internet the fuck you tell me in the comments. You punk pussy beta bagel biting bitch ass nigga. What the fuck you tell me, dude? What's the difference between full time MMA and MMA quick tits? Full time MMA isn't a baby back bagel biting backyard bandit bitch boy. Fuck you tell me, dude.